everyone seeks comfort and security, right? It's hardwired into us. Yet those who are able to push themselves and reach their goals in business and in life have one unique characteristic. And that one unique characteristic is the ability to be uncomfortable. Picture it like this. Imagine you've got two concentric circles, kind of like a target, one circle inside another circle. The inner circle is your comfort zone. The larger outer circle is the world of the unknown, anything that's unknown to yourself. And in this world of the unknown, that's where things like uncertainty reside, discomfort, pain, anxiety, all that negative stuff. Now, most people live the majority of their lives in the inner circle, in the comfort zone. A dead-end job or a dead-end relationship is a perfect example of staying inside the world of the known, the comfort zone, right? Now, as far as business is concerned, what a lot of people do, and a lot of people stay stuck here for years and years and years, a lot of people stay inside their business comfort zone, and they stay inside that comfort zone essentially playing business. You know, they redesign their business card for the fourth time this year, or they get their logo redesigned yet again, or their web website <laughs> redesigned yet again. They do everything within their business except actually going outside of their comfort zone, getting out into the dark, real world of discomfort, making sales calls, trying to land sales, and so on. All the busy work of business all resides inside the comfort zone. Your comfort zone is safe. It's, again, the world of the known. It's warm and cozy and fuzzy and safe, right? The problem is, in the short term, it doesn't lead anywhere. And in the long term, it leads off a cliff one way or another. Eventually, if you stay inside your comfort zone for too long, you're going off a cliff. So short term, the comfort zone is safe. Long term, the comfort zone is <laughs> extremely dangerous, let's say. People who get the most out of life, who get the most out of their businesses, who are striving for worthy goals and objectives, are able to get themselves to venture out into the world of the unknown. And I get it. It's uncomfortable. It's sometimes painful, it's upsetting sometimes, and scary, definitely. And even though it's painful, the people who are able to build their businesses and live life on their terms, well, they are able to get themselves to do this anyway, in spite of the fear, in spite of the discomfort, in spite of it being dark and scary, they can get themselves to do it anyway. And you want to know something? At first, they make all kinds of mistakes. They mess up. They fail over and over. Anytime you step outside of your comfort zone, you should be expecting to trip all over yourself and mess it all up and to definitely not get it right or perfect the first time. And this makes perfect sense because we're doing something outside the world of the known. Anything that's outside of our comfort zone, the world of the known, is obviously residing inside the world of the unknown. <laughs> How can you possibly expect to be good at something that is unknown to you, that you're not comfortable doing, right? So people who reach their goals in life and in business are willing to put themselves through temporary, underlined temporary, discomfort in order to get what they're striving for. All right, now, I hope you're enjoying this kind of content, and I got to tell you, it doesn't stop here. Let's go even more in-depth with all this stuff, and that's exactly what I've got for you over at 10tononline.com forward slash free. There, what you'll find is a free online business workshop, which has been carefully set up to give you clear insights and key info to help get you set up right the first time. I will see you there, my friend. Thank you.